Hey everyone, so my cousin found this uh, sweet little pit bull or pit bull mix. I'm not too sure. She kind of looked like she had a really slenderish face, but I mean, I don't know. My dog had um, a little bit of a thicker face. Not really like a bulldog thick, but just like thicker face. Anyways, I don't know her breed. She is cute. That's all I know. And um, she was a stray. My cousin found her um, around 4 o'clock. It's 5.19 now. And I felt like I had to make this video um, to get out that, you know, um, she's, she's in Passaic Animal shelter now if this is the owner if the owner is listening in on this shame on you because um with the size of the dog obviously um you'll know that they're missing um also shame on you because she was definitely she definitely had patches of of, of fur um just off. Um, I don't mean to be judgmental, but this is something that I would not have wanted for my dog. And I had a pit bull too. I had an all white male pit bull. Um, another reason why I said shame on you is because, you know, <clears throat> there are a lot of people that will do mean things to dogs but there are even more mean people that will do th bad things to pit bulls. Um, whether they're dog fighters, they want them as um, bait dogs, whether they want them as um, fighting dogs. And in this little girl's case, uh, if she wasn't fixed, a breeding dog. And they would have just bred her until she passed away. Um, and that's just... That's just a shame. That is a shame. Um, this, is, this is really, really pissing me off. I mean, she, she is a sweet dog. You know, and I hope she does find a good home. I just wanted to show you a small little clip of, of what I saw when we were... She's a sweetheart. I mean, there's, there's, no, there's no way around it. I can't keep her. I'm in an apartment. I did have a pit bull, but we moved here because of him. We wanted we wanted to keep him. Um, the reason why we can't keep her is pretty much um, because we're we're about to move, and um, we're trying to uh, we're trying to get our own place. Um, his mom, my husband's mom. Uh, lives with us. She does not want another dog, and we are trying to respect her wishes, but unfortunately, um, that just collides with actually keeping this dog. Um, I would have just probably taken her upstairs, washed her, and then slowly but surely um, gotten her in contact with my daughter while my husband was here. Um, because you definitely don't want to, um, you definitely don't want to take a dog and you don't know if they're comfortable with children. Um, or who knows, maybe I would have just found a trainer and had them train her to, um, to pretty much be around children but 
She, like I said, she was a good dog. I didn't see any problems with her, except for the fur. Um, and that is that is pretty much that's pretty much it. Um, like I said, if you want to get in contact with the people who are holding her now, um, she is probably going to be in the uh, Passaic Animal Shelter, and. Like I said, you can look up the, you could go up the phone number, no problem. Um, today is Monday. Today is Monday, and I'm going to be posting this on Thursday. Actually, I really want to post this up today, so I'll probably post this up today, and um, we'll see, we'll see the turnout. Um, if, if you do get in contact with the shelter and, um, you do find out what's going on with her, um, comment, do a comment. Um, I'm probably going to call up the shelter, see how they're, how she's doing in about a couple of days. Um, if not, then on Thursday and then I uh, will put it in the description of how she's doing like I said I do hope she gets a good home I don't know if I if I'm hoping that she goes back to her old home but uh we'll see what happens you know like a, <sighs> I mean shit happens I guess but if you lost your child like that I'm pretty sure there would be a whole lot more repercussions, and that's unfortunate. Um, I know, I know what people are probably thinking: children over dogs. This is just a dog, but it's a living. It's living. It is a living creature. It's a living creature that you pretty much. Um, said, I'm going to take care of for the rest of your life. So, yeah, it is a creature, and a living creature, and you were supposed to take care of it, and you, you didn't. You freaking didn't. And that's the reason why I feel like some people really, really need to have a little bit more of a harsh, um, harsh consequences when they do stuff like this. That's just my thought. Um, if you feel like I'm wrong, say it in the comments. Um, if you think I'm right, again, say it in the comments. Um, but, you know, do it with respect. No name calling. Because I will not respond to you if you decide to just sound like a troll. Um... And that's pretty much it. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to know more about the videos that I make, feel free to subscribe. And uh, thanks for watching. Take care.